Welcome back everyone. I got an update on my Crossman 2240. <coughs> uh, after I got it yesterday, I uh, I looked at it and I said I got to do something with it. After I shot it a few times and, well, this is the, the finished result. I did the vinegar thing. I Put the 14 inch barrel, the 7 inch barrel, the new steel breech, and the the gas tube, and all the the screws and everything, all in, all in vinegar. Did the trigger as well, jeweled the trigger, jeweled the bolt. I don't know if you can really see the jeweling on the bolt. It's not really showing up all that much. There it is. You can see the jeweling on the trigger though. What jeweling is, uh, it's a... A thing that gunsmiths do, my dad was a gunsmith, well still is, <coughs> and it's uh, <clears throat> an abrasive stick that you stick in a in a drill press, and you have a jig for jeweling bolts and, and triggers and, uh, and hammers and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I had a few sticks here, I just, I just actually used the last little bit of the last stick I had. Uh, I don't think I'll be getting any more because they're expensive sticks. It, all, it, it adds value to guns because uh, it dresses them up. But yeah, that's what I did. Just did, did it on the bolt and the trigger. Looks really good though. I haven't shot the gun yet. I just got it all back together and just put the scope on it. The scope's a, a rifle scope. I'm just going to just test it out just for now until I get a scope. I'm probably gonna put, probably going to put a red dot on it. <clears throat> Yeah, I haven't, haven't fired it with the 14-inch barrel yet. <coughs> Sorry if I seem, if I sound groggy. I'm, I'm getting getting over a cold. Here's the other side of it. Yep, I just uh, soaked it in vinegar. All the the steel parts that I wanted the bluing off of, just soaked them in vinegar for about a half an hour, and then just took. Uh, a regular old kitchen scrub sponge and scrubbed them down and once all the blowing was off them I just took a piece of 4-0 steel wool and just polished them right up and they turned out really good I'm actually really really happy with the way it turned out so yeah that's the Craftsman 2240 with the new steel breech on it and the 14 inch barrel and pretty much looks like stainless now okay see you later